it has been famously said that if you really want to do something either you do it this way or that way but what matters is you are doing it so we will be seeing this formula today hello and welcome to the in-depth series section of drishti ias i am aisha singh and in today's video we will be discussing about the topic which is presently going on in the news because of a release of a movie so that and that is about the donkey flights or the donkey method or the donkey terminology which is in news and this is not something which which you will relate with the word donkey it is about illegal immigration method so there is something called donkey flights and it is related to an illegal immigration method so let us first see first we'll be looking at the news then about the latin american route that how people from india are moving to other countries like the uk or the us and then crossing of forest expensive journey and, and then about the prelims mcq topic is of relevance from G gs paper 2 that is international relations and then paper 3 that is security so the news talks about theme of srk's donkey which is the donkey route dangerous path to the american dream so the name of the movie has been kept on the theme that is donkey route so what is this donkey route we'll just be knowing and this is considered to be a very dangerous path to the american dream so what happens is that people from our country or people from all over the world wants to achieve a better standard of living and wants to earn more so in that sense they are they move or they try to move to other countries like the united states of america or the united kingdom in search of better living standard better job better pay scale so if they are not able to go by a legal route or a legal method then what they do is they try the illegal route to reach that destination and that illegal route through which they reach the destination is termed as the donkey flight or the donkey method like for example imagine a person from india wants to go to us and the person is in search for a better pay scale better money better living standard and wants to earn more and send money home but the person is not able to generate visa on time and is not being able to generate the required document so what the person will do and nowadays what the people are doing that they if they are not able to go by the legal method then they are adopting the illegal methods to reach their destinations like for example if directly they are not able to go to the united states of america they will uh, they will indulge in an illegal manner like for example they will first go to some other country then they, they will take a halt and will get in touch with different kind of agents who will take them illegally to their destination going through many parts and it will take many days and months also to reach the destination so they will first take a halt in some other country then they will go to some other destination then they will go to some other destination like for example you can say that if a person wants to go from india to us then the first the person will be taken to middle east then to some other latin american countries then from that the person will pass on to some other countries and then it will he or she will reach the border of the united states of america and then he or she will try to go inside the country so let's see donkey flights is an illegal immigration technique first of all it is illegal it is not legal it is punishable offense and then immigration technique it means entering into some other country and it provides back door entry into the united states united kingdom and canada back door entry it because it is considered to be illegal it can be considered a front door entry if it would have been legal with proper documents and the illegal trip a lot of people take to get out of their country across borders all over the world and nowadays this is very much in news and there are so many people who are adopting this method then people continue risking everything for the for their american 
dream and the dream is about having a better employment opportunity better standard of living better pay scale able to send money home or etc now first stop is the latin america now we will be taking the example of someone moving from india to the united states of america so the first stop that the person considers see what happens first of all is that the person who is not able to go legally to the united states of america will first come in touch with the agents who who have a lot of contacts in terms of the human trafficking so that they can send a person across continents and this is a very 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 expensive process also so the first step in the most popular donkey route from india is to reach a latin american country latin american country means you can say the central american countries then countries like ecuador bolivia and guyana have visa on arrival for indian citizens now what happens is that whenever a person from india comes to these latin american countries who have visa on arrival so they directly come to those countries and then they take visa of that country directly they can they do not go to the united states of america then they go to the country which is nearby united states of america and then they take visa of those countries like for example this is the united states of america and these are the latin american countries so the person will first go from india to some country of the arabian peninsula or the middle east then the then the person will come to some of the latin american countries like for example guyana or the ecuador or some other country then the person will stay here for some time then brazil and venezuela give tourist visas to indians easily and it can take months and agents they the links they have of human trafficking network and better links the agents have better they are able to send people and easily they are able to send people now what happens is like when a person reaches countries like ecuador or guyana which has visa on arrival now the person goes there then the person try to stay there for as long as possible and then comes in contact with the agents and agents then through these countries send the person through the panama canal to other countries and it is basically the countries like nicaragua or the guatemala which serves as a halt for these people and then from there they, the people move with the help of the agents to countries like mexico and reach the united states of america's border and when they reach the united states of america's border there is a fencing on between us and mexico it is more than 3000 kilometers long fence and then the person tries to move off move from that fence but the real problem is not moving off this fence but the real problem is that when the person gets into the united states of america then the person should also be fit to take asylum into the country and that is when the 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 dealing between the police and all the other authorities of the other country also comes into the picture and it is considered to be a very 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 difficult phase and it takes a lot of time from months to year also it can take then crossing a dangerous forest so from colombia the migrants enter panama as i just showed you in the map and panama has a very dense forest so this crossing of the panama forest has a lot of risk because it is a long forest and this long forest will have lack of clean water wild animals will be there criminal gangs will be there robbery can happen any point of time and even rape in this region and most of the crimes which is committed in this region they are not reported they go unpunished and unreported and then from these the people reach to other countries like mexico and then they can see their american dream getting fulfilled so this is the concept of donkey 
flight that if a person goes wants to go from one place number one to two if not able to go directly then the person will take different route but it he or she will reach the destination or the place where they wants to go now there is a new route also which is coming up and that is the person first is going to the european countries and then from there they directly go to the mexico because the european countries has a schengen visa which means that if the country if if a person enters any country of the schengen visa then the person will be able to move inside almost all the countries of the schengen visa without any other visa needed and then to go to the uk europe route is preferred because uk is very near or the very the proximity is near with the europe as compared to other countries then why do people go through the illegal route as i have told you there are so many reasons but even though this route is so expensive by going through the illegal route people have to spend from 15 lakh to 40 lakh and it can even go up to 75 lakhs and a cr but still people do that because with what they think is that the amount they are spending as of now is nothing what they can do if they reach the destination then failing what is dangerous also that if a person fails to make payment then what can happen is it can be a matter of life and death for the migrant and usually what happens is that the payment is done in installment like for example like this is just an example which i'm giving you people like for example before one installment is made before the journey before the journey and then second installment you can say is made when a person reaches the midpoint and the third and the final installment is made when the person almost reaches the destination or the border of that country so this is a dangerous process as many people have lost their lives while going into the while going into this journey because don't think that this journey is taking days this can take one month to five months to ten months to year to two years so this is a long journey and people do not have drinking proper drinking water proper food to eat so many people have lost their lives in between the journey now in the end a prelims mcq the darien gap is situated in which country so when a person moves from india to us then through the panama canal when the person is moving there is a gap which which the person has to cross and that the gap is called the darien gap so which is situated in which country panama venezuela nicaragua or colombia so give me the answer in the comment section and that's all for today thank you so much for watching till we meet next time keep reading and keep writing